Hi everyone, Dr. Wes from Merge Health and in this video I'm going to be talking about mindfulness, self-compassion and uh, from a doctor's perspective. And so I think I'll just start off by saying that if you do a Google search, there is a lot of evidence for mindfulness, this concept of mindfulness, self-compassion, which is uh, essentially being kind to, to yourself. And um, I was just having a bit of a think about what this actually means for the average person in the context of illness. Uh, and there is an old saying that says, what a, what a man thinks, so he is. So um, I think it, it is quite possible that the, uh, that the th thoughts that we have and the the thoughts that we have towards ourself have a role in our illness. I suppose you only have to have a look at the rates of depression and how that associates with other forms of chronic illness. Um, and there are definitely increased rates of chronic illness with regards when related to depression. Um, so, I'll, I, I want to give you just a practical tip that next time this happens, when you find yourself thinking of a critical thought towards yourself. So for example, you might be thinking, I could have done better in, this, in that situation. Um, you can stop. And yes, that, that statement might, might be true. But you might also be thinking of a critical thought like, I failed and um, I really should have done better. In that situation, stop, think about an affirmation. For example, I am worthy of love or abundance and love flow from me. You only have to Google uh, mindfulness, self-compassion quotes to come up with a thought like that or a quote like that and stop and have a think about how you uh, yeah uh, think about that thought or that quote and have a think about it for some time and see if in the long run that actually changes the way you respond to things this is something that needs to be practiced something that needs to be practiced every day, just like everything else. Um, would love to hear your thoughts and your comments about that, and uh, we'll catch you in the next video.